that fender flew off the car, now on my workbench, which needs to be cleaned up. Huge thanks to my friend Will for pulling over and picking up my fender. I'm gonna walk through uh, the failure mode and what I'm gonna do in the future. I mount the fenders to my car with bond-in studs and strap clamps. My first iteration I used an epoxy. It doesn't bond particularly well to the uh, fiberglass, so occasionally it would pop off. So my solution to that was actually to use a more robust adhesive, uh, this stuff. It's not coming off. So what had happened was the bond-in studs, for whatever reason, uh, nuts backed out something, I don't know. Um, should have been lock nuts, but whatever. Uh, so eventually, the strap clamps came off, the fender peeled away from the car. The back of the fender is where I had these studs bonded in with the panel bond. Um, and if you look closely, what you can tell is that the bonded studs uh, with the panel bond really actually ripped the fiberglass out of the fenders. These were like super tough. These didn't fail. This is the thing that failed. Strap clamps that I'm using, I uh, 3D printed them. Uh, these are out of PET G. Uh, these have held up pretty well. That fender, clamps are perfectly fine. I would fix it now, but I don't care because I'm about to head off to England. And I may pick up a set of carbon fiber wings and redo the whole thing, but using the panel.